Back in 2007, someone paid a rather hefty price for a car. A limousine of the McLaughlin Buick variety made by General Motors of Canada. This custom-built vehicle made from Oshawa, Ontario, was for none other than the Prince of Wales, later known for a hot second as King Edward VIII. And this was his car, built the way he wanted it. It had cabinets for drinks, uh, reading lights, a built-in radio even. Like, this thing was posh. Proper posh. He'd even travel around in the car with Wallace Simpson with the blinds closed so they could have a bit of privacy. And therein lies the tragedy of King Edward VIII. He couldn't marry the woman he wanted to without abdicating the throne. That and his Nazi wings. And on 10th of December, 1936, he was driven up in this very vehicle to Downing Street to explain to the Prime Minister that, uh, didn't want to be king anymore. And that was that. The next day, he had his infamous radio broadcast, and then he got into his McLaughlin Buick and drove off into the sunset. Or at least that's the story told by Bonhams, the auctioneer. So was it real? Well, <laughs> Probably. The Oshawa Public Library has a few photos in its collection of this car actually being built. So if you ever want your own locally sourced royal car, it's gonna set you back about 185,000 American. That's how much got shelled out back in 2007, so probably a little more than that. Hmm. Open up a line of credit. <laughs>